Can you see where the arrow is pointed in this radiograph? Can you guess what's the problem with this patient? To know more, please tune in. This is a Be Kind to Pets veterinary educational videos sponsored by Topayo Vet. Veterinary medicine and surgery come alive to vet students and pet owners. This video is a continuation of the case of a limping Jack Russell Terrier. For the history, this patient came in for a second opinion. The first vet did the radiographic examination and the owner decided to go to Topayo Vets for diagnosis and treatment. Please let them make sure they are. Put it down first. Let it You will see that to the length of the hind leg, if there's a location, the length will be one of the shorter. Only you shorter when you extend the hip there. Mm. It's quite painful, but you can tell it's shorter definitely. So, okay, turn, turn to the side. Okay. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Ah, okay. Now oh, there's some pain. Okay, so do the systematic check from the toes. Although we know it's the hip now. Do the check any fracture or not? No. Okay, then the hock. Okay. Okay, so no, no pain, no swelling. So this side is okay now. The knee, this is the knee. Now knee there is pain, no? there is pain there is the knee. So most likely it could be the knee. It could be patella luxation. No? Check and see. Now go to the hip. This radiograph is taken from the first vet. On this case, the x-ray view should be confined to the hip and knee areas, and a better quality image is needed. So after the consultation, the doctor advised to do another radiographic examination for more clearer view. On the ventrodorsal view, you can easily see that the head of the femur is outside the hip joint socket, which means there is a hip dislocation. Also, in the lateral view, the pointed arrow shows the head of the femur displays upward. Therefore, the diagnosis of this case is hip dislocation of right hip joint. Treatment This case have a surgical and non-surgical approach. For the surgical treatment, FHO should be done. FHO or femoral head osteotomy is a surgical operation to remove the head and neck from the femur. It is performed to alleviate pain and is a salvage procedure, reserved for condition where pain cannot be alleviated in any other way. The other option is the Emmer sling, which is a non-surgical treatment to ensure that the femoral head is kept back into the hip joint to allow healing and creation of a false joint. Since the dog is 12 years old and the anesthetic risk is higher if femoral head osteotomy is done, the owner option for Emmer sling. The sling should be kept on for around 4 weeks. If this treatment is unsuccessful, FHO should be the only option. Currently, the patient is still hospitalized and is doing well. Advices to pet owners. Trauma is the most common cause of hip dislocation. The patient was playing with the German Shepherd when it happened. If you have a large and small breed of dogs, be mindful that sometimes playing could cause injury or trauma to both. If your pet was diagnosed with this condition, preventing them from tremendous activity and giving supplementation would be of great help. If your pet shows any unusual signs, always seek veterinary professional advice. I hope you learned something in this video. Thank you for watching. For more information, please visit thepyvets.com.